three TRX exercises where you are standing facing your anchor point. The first one is your overhead back extension. So start in this star position. Tension is on the TRX. I'm leaning back, core's tight, shoulders down. From there, I am sitting back or falling back and then squeezing up by squeezing my shoulders, pulling my arms overhead. So there's my back extension, exhaling, pulling up. So drop back. That's the only time you're allowed to jackknife in your TRX and squeeze up and drop back and squeeze up. So a really good shoulder and back exercise. All right, the next one is a set of deltoid flies. So you want the TRX mid length and we're going to start with a T. So find your end position, looking up, lean or fall back and pull yourself forward with by using your deltoids, which are right at the back of your shoulders. So squeezing out to the side, core's engaged, and pulling and uh, letting yourself back slowly. So here I am resisting, nice and slow, squeezing out. Do not fall back, guys. Keep even resistance through the movement. And then we're going to go to a Y fly. So my Y fly finishes here. Unlike your overhead back extension, you're making sure you're keeping that plank position. You're not hinging at the hips. You're squeezing up. So then you can put those two together and you're going to do a T followed by a Y. And you should be feeling this at the back of your shoulders. So there's my T and there's my Y. So that is your deltoid T and Y. The last one that we're going to do facing is down on the ground using a mat. This is called the half kneeling fallout. So I've got my left foot forward, tensions in the TRX, and I'm pressing out at a 45 degree angle and coming back and pressing out and coming back. And I'm really feeling this in my inner thigh. I'm also feeling it in my core. And then of course I'm going to change legs. Your alternate thing to do is to do a fallout from here and you just, you're on your knees. Oh my gosh, that's so hard. <laughs> so you fall forward, but you don't hinge. You've got to keep that plank position, but those are a couple of fallouts that you can do on the floor.